first things first, you're here in D.C. and I know you're a busy woman. What brought you all the way out to D.C.? My buddy Gladys Knight is being honored, which she is so deserving of it. I opened for her actually um, many moons ago. And so when the Kennedy Center Honors asked me to be a part of the artist committee this year, I was so thrilled that they were honoring her. Um, of course, who doesn't love George Clooney? I mean, I mean it was worth deal. getting on the plane just, <laughs> just for him. Have you met him? No, you know, this will be my first time actually meeting him. I, of course, I've always talked about him and reported on him. Yeah. So, and Amy Grant and, you know, you two, who doesn't love them? So this is just a wonderful night. And I grew up watching the Kennedy Center Honors, so I'm just happy to be here, happy to be part of the committee. Now, are you doing anything on stage tonight for Gladys? I'm going to just scream. <laughs> Cheerleader in the front if, row. If they need a pip, I'm, I could be a pipette. <laughs> I love it. You are a woman of many talents. And I have to tell you, you know, it, it was so bittersweet watching the reel come to an end. It was a show that was so beloved and cherished by people like me around the world. Now that it's been a few months, has it set in that that, that chapter is over? Oh, definitely. And you know what? It allows me, I just did another movie. Mm. I'm doing uh, work with Kennedy Center. I'm doing uh, other projects. So that's the thing about when you're a comedian like me, yeah. you're multifaceted and you're doing other, you know, things. So, I mean, I love the girl. Girls. We still keep in contact. The Adrian, group chat alive? Oh, the group chat. I mean, they got kids now. Adrian just had a baby. You know, I have to, you know, still be Auntie Liney. So it's bittersweet, but you know what? We're all moving on and it's a great thing. We live in an age of reboots and revivals. If there was a chance to get the real 2.0 booted up, would you be a part of it? Oh, definitely. Well, what I mean, take? I don't know, but you know what? Everybody's so busy now, you know, it's like get a whole new group of girls. Okay. That's what I say. Well, listen, you and I have spoken about how much we love Kiki Palmer. I know you congratulated her on Instagram oh, last night. Have you spoken with her since this big reveal? You know what? We were DMing each other because I've been trying to keep it a secret. So you knew. <laughs> you knew. I was like, I was like, I, okay, you know, Auntie Lottie, go be quiet. <laughs> but I just love the way that she did it and we're just so happy for her and she's happy and healthy and that's what matters. Congratulations, Kiki. I love it. Chances of you and her maybe sitting on a panel together, Ooh. getting a little show going? You know, we already tried that remember we tried that and she ended up um going to gma3 and then i ended up going to the real so look we're doing other things now okay auntie lonnie you're gonna be around for babysitting right yes i am <laughs>